In other news, a Super Puma helicopter is now in the hands of a polytechnic to enhance the learning experience of students taking aeronautical and aerospace diplomas. Polytechnics are committed to investing in hardware such as aircraft to give students better career prospects. Sabrina Ng with more. This is actually a fully operational helicopter, mainly used for search and rescue missions. The AS-332 Super Puma is now housed inside Singapore Polytechnic as part of an agreement with the Singapore Air Force to enhance the school's aeronautical and aerospace diplomas. Students learn how to repair and maintain parts of an aircraft in a controlled setting like a classroom. But learning for them goes beyond the classroom with an aircraft like this one. With this real craft, they're actually able to see what they just learned about in a classroom translate into an actual craft on an actual system. Previously, SP had used the UH-1 Iroquois helicopter for aircraft maintenance training. But the Super Puma is equipped with a digital avionics system that is more reflective of current technology. Such hands-on learning helps students visualise concepts better. When it's textbook, it's, you can't really imagine what you're doing. But for, the, uh, for hands-on, you know what you're doing and then it's easier when it's in during exam. The Super Puma is a donation from the RSAF. And SP says it will continue to upgrade its training equipment to help the students stay ahead of the curve. As an educational incident, we also have to move with technology and this aircraft will help move our, upgrade our modules also for SP, aeronautical and aerospace electronic graduates. Uh, they have no problem flying employment and uh, they actually move not only just on the engineering level, they also move up the ladder. SP is not the only school using such learning aids. Over in Niam Polytechnic, the school has its own Airbus A320 flight simulator and the Dassault Falcon 10 business jet. And efforts continue in upgrading teaching tools. Recently, we have also focused on digitalizing our training for the growing maintenance, repair and overhaul, MR in short, uh, industry. Uh, we introduced technologies like uh, AI, robotics, holograms and Arduino programming to better prepare students for the evolving and future workplace. Mr Ng says the school will work closely with industry partners to ensure that students learn relevant practical skills to help them find jobs.